Welcome to another day in my life as a physical education teacher, teaching the men of tomorrow. It doesn't get any better than this and it doesn't get any harder than this. Welcome to class. <laughs> from which to answer when um, your team your team gets chosen hello join Alex group sit at the back right there sit at the back right there because you're late so join that group all right so who wants to go first which group wants to go first so we, we're keeping up we're keeping the score which group going first me your group yeah. so your group A yeah. all right go hear me all right. So when I've asked the question, rules are the game, right? So when I've asked the question, yes. when we watch school challenge quiz, we don't hear anybody repeating anything, right? So you have to listen, right? If it is your group to answer and you don't know the question, by the time I'm finished counting now 10 seconds, it goes to the other team and they don't lose their chance to answer. Please no shouting. Please no shouting, all right? All right, so first question goes to team A, which is Alex team. The international governing body for cricket is the A, I, C, C, B, I, O, C, 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 A, C, D, C, W, I. A, correct? I, C. Question two. What is meant by the term Paralympics? Is it A, a set of games, for retired professional athletes? Is it B, competition for individuals with disabilities? C, Olympic Games for children under the age of 12? Or D, team sports for all men and women? Good. Team B. You say C, J, Roy? You'd have been incorrect. B. 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 Hold on. Decide your answer. Is it, are you saying B or are you saying D? Because you are saying different answers. B, and you would have been correct. B says competition for individuals with disabilities. I asked about Paralympics. D says team sports for all sportsmen and women. All right, next question for team B. Which of the following is the lowest level of or instructional organization in the human body? Is it A, cell, B, organ, C, tissue, D, system? Ah! I said team A, you're B. No, I said team A. My, my, my apologies, your question. A, correct. A cell. Team B. The main function of the hinge joint is is it A pivoting, B circumduction, C flexion, flexion and extension, D abduction and adduction. Hinge. Main function of the hinge joint. Time. Moving on to team A. Incorrect. Throw it back to you. Choose on it. Choose on it. Yes, I see. Yes, I could see. All right. Correct. See, correct. So, your qu whose question was this? No. Alright. Which of the following systems sends messages between the brain and the body? Is it A, the nervous system, B, muscular system, C, excretory system, or D, circulatory system? A, A, nervous system. Nervous system. Are you going for a question? Oh, I'm going to I thought it was their question. I'm going to tell you. Most of the questions that have been given came on the test. 
Question, Team B's question. The modern Olympic Games was started by, is it A, W.G. Grace, B, Haslick Crawford, C, Baron Pierre de Coburg, Cobertin, or is it D, Christian Empire Theodos? Can I repeat the question, the answers? B, B is incorrect. A is incorrect. C is incorrect. Hold yeah, yeah, yeah. on, C correct. C correct. C is correct. So the question is your question, team A. Which of the following is a function of the human circulatory system? Is it A, moves bones? Is it B, produces enzymes? Or is it C, transports impulses? Or D, transports nutrients? Nope. 10, 9, 8. Huh? Some of the cycle you had guessed your way through life, you know. Correct! <laughs> Correct! Transport <laughs> new trends. <laughs> because, like, oh, uh, Mr. Kepler had guessed your nice. way through life. Very good. The answer to questions correct so far. Question. TV's question. In the human. In humans. Stop the talking. If you're talking, I'm going to take a point. I don't remember either answer of this guy. In humans, the biological name for the windpipe is it A, larynx, B, trachea, C, bronchi, D, throat. Incorrect. What? No. You are to be listening. That's what I said. That's why you're to listen. That's what I said. <laughs> In humans, the biological name for the windpipe is it A, larynx, B, trachea, C, bronchi, D, throat? A, larynx. Incorrect. C. C. Huh? C. Incorrect. So nobody can get a question again. Trachea. We can't be so that they are Nobody gets it. Nobody gets it. Bones can be classified into groups as short, long, flat, or irregular. To which group do the vertebrae belong? A flat, B short, C long, D irregular. Really? You're answering? What did you say? Irregular. Sorry. No! Alright, I'm going to wipe the smile off my face. Next question. <laughs> No, because of what you said through that's what they are. A sprinter is asked to include weight training and plyometrics in his or her workout. Which fitness, which fitness component will this improve? A power, B balance, C coordination, D reaction time. A sprint correct. Team A. During which part of a training program is emphasis placed on maintaining general fitness and flexibility through active rest? A. Pre-season B. Off-season C. Pre-peak season D. Pre-competition A. A. Correct. Team B. Aerobics as physical activity contributes best to a flexibility, B endurance, C balance, A agility. Hmm? C incorrect. Correct. Which of the following sports related fitness test measures coordination? A alternate handball throw, B standing broad jump, C 10 minutes shuttle run, D, start stand. Eight. Correct. <laughs> which of the following, which of the following skills is classified as open? Is it A, front crawl, B, forward roll, C, gymnastic vaulting, or D, volleyball spike? 10, 9, 8, 7, 8, Hold on. Hold on. Decide an answer. Because two different answers are made. Eh? Where's the 
Let's say DRB. D. Nicholas can perform badminton techniques almost effortlessly. This skill learning phase is called A. Cognitive, B. Beginners, C. Associative, D. Autonomous. Correct. Most of these questions you have gotten already. Next question. Which of the following situation does not, and OT all caps, does not contribute to injury prevention? A. Lack of fitness. B. Warming up and cooling down. C. Following the rules of the game. D. Using correct gear and equipment. Which of the following situations does not contribute to injury prevention? Nope. No, 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 no. Time is correct. Run upon them, Mr. Keppel. Run upon them, Mr. Keppel. You come right out. You come on. Tennis elbows and the cricketer's shoulders are injuries of which type? Is it A, overuse, B, violence, C, accidental, D, environmental? Dear question. D. Incorrect. Oh, Run upon them. <laughs> Run upon them. Yeah, you. Yeah, give them the little one there. And I can pick. But I pick that too. Your question now. Which of the following techniques is used to treat a sprain of the ankle? Is it A, A, B, C, B, C, P, R, C, M, M, Z, D, R, I, C, E? Incorrect! Incorrect! Oh God, we just did. Incorrect. Come back to me. C, R, C, P, R. Who said E? Correct. Right! R, I, C, E. Oh no God, no! CPR? We don't really have to use CPR to treat tennis in tennis elbow. We don't. We give up. Oh no, we don't. Alex, this is the question. The question says tennis elbows and cricketer shoulders are examples. Sorry, wrong question. Which of the following techniques is used to treat the sprain of an ankle? A, A, B, C, C, P, R, M, M, V, R, I, C, E. I wanna really pick C, P, R. Mm. So, now I wanna do, do C, P, R for your uncle. Alright, so your question, team A. In netball games, Mary constantly drops the ball whenever it is passed too quickly to her. How can the coach assist in correcting this problem? Is it A, avoiding passing the ball to Mary? B, have players pass the ball with less force? C, practice catching skill more in training? Or D, explain the importance of catching the ball correctly? B, no, incorrect. Ah, your partner, your partner did give the correct answer. C, correct. So you're going to explain yeah. no because Alex gave the incorrect answer first. Oh, I don't know. I see no yes. <laughs> no, he mean you first, Tim. That's what he means. You answered first. Alright, next question. Which of the following? Listen now. Whose question? Alright, B. Which of the following? Which food nutrient is best is the best? Choice when attempting carb loading before an activity? Is it A protein, B starch, C water, C fats, D fats? Sorry. Water. Let me just want to join you. Protein. Let me 
so and Joe the Quad. In Kirk, so nobody got the answer. Starch. 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 Protein give you to you get protein from vegetables? No. Protein you get from meat. You never ask about meat. Meat, egg, cheese, protein. Carboloading, carbohydrate, starch, yum, banana, bread, biscuit. Which of the which sporting organization chooses the host city for the Olympic Games? Is it IAAS, FISA, ICC, or IOC? <laughs> I don't see the question. I see them question. I see your question. I see it. IO? Which self again? IAAS. No, you're saying IAAS, incorrect. IOC. IOC, correct. <laughs> Alex, you're sleeping. You're sleeping, Alex. Please wake up, Alex. Alex, I sleep over here, so. The ability to change directions quickly while moving relates to is it A, reaction time, B, coordination, C, agility, or D, speed? The ability to change directions quickly while moving relates to reaction time, coordination, agility, speed. Incorrect. The no. demand is already, them get it incorrect. Your question, Alex. Agility. So why do you have to see people like you not sure you don't get to agree? Alright, so see, sorry. Causes the entire body to move forward while immersed in water. Is it A, floating, B, buoyancy, C, propulsion, D, streamlining? I know your question. I feel the one. Oh, alright, sorry, you're incorrect. Incorrect. A, C. C. Correct. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> Correct. Yeah. So the final question is, and we're going to discuss some things about SBA. Which of the following factors should not be considered when organizing sports programs for young people? Is it A, skill level of the sport, B, ethnic background, C, size and weight, or D, age and gender? Which of the following factors should not be considered when organizing sports programs for young people? Is it A, skill level of the sport, B, ethnic background, C, size and weight, D, age and gender? Incorrect. B is correct. Ethnic background. Energy we So at the end of the match, the winner of the match is the team A with 13 points and the team B with 9 points. Congratulations. <laughs> And you got nine. All right. So today is the um, Daniel 
You really want me to take a shoes brush and fry your brother, brother? Put on your shoes brush, brother, brother. I don't have time for clean shoes now, Papa. No, you're not brush off, no dust in the class. Alright, so this is the final class that we're having for grade 10. So the next time that I see you guys, you're going to be in grade 11, right? Before I, yes, before I remember, um, on Wednesday we have Boys and Girls Day, and on Thursday, exam officially begins. All right, so before we, we talk on what is to happen in grade 10, grade 11 rather, remember I said this is your last class for grade 10, right? Um, mostly you joined my class late, some started from the, the get-go. I want to take this time to encourage each and every one of you, please remember that an education is your platform to greater things. Not because you are in a particular situation now means that this is where you are destined to be. A lot of us, we are wasting our time. We are wasting our time when we come to class or we come to school. We don't make the effort to come inside the classroom and learn something. We are always depending on a particular person to answer. We need to start shaping up from now. As I said before, Please take your own education very seriously. No one can take it serious for you. You have to take it serious for yourself. You have to know what is it that you want when you leave here. Remember, you are not going to be in grade 10 forever. This is your last couple of months left in grade 10. The next time I see you again in a classroom setting, you are going to be 11 graders. You are going to be preparing for CXC. This is the moment that you would have all been working for or looking forward to. All right? With that being said, when we read, before I reach there, remember I said we got two chances for the recommendation period because I'm not going to be sorry for anybody and recommend you. I'm going to recommend you based on your performance. That performance is the written test. All right? We said that we had, I gave two chances for for recommendation one chance has already passed so far only alex is on to round two only alex so if you don't pass the end of your exam which is 65 percent you would have cheated yourself out of an opportunity to do the subject at cxc all right that's different but if you get 40 30 tell to the no all right now when you reach grade 11, right, we have to put on an activity or you have to put on, I don't know why I keep saying we have to when I have nothing to do with it. You have to put on an activity. As I was saying, we have, you have to put on an activity, a sports related activity when you reach grade 11. This is normally done in the first term of school, which is September, between September to December, right? You have to plan an activity. You have to choose the roles within the activity and you have to, you are going to be the ones who decide the rules for the activity. Now I want everyone to sit down. Even if you are not recommended for CXC, you have to play a role in the SBA. Let me repeat myself. Even if you are not recommended for CXC, you have to play a role in the CXC it's going to be your final grade for your report. Everybody get that? Why is nobody answering? Okay. So, everybody has to choose a role. So, if we're going to say, put on a netball competition, we need a competition director, we need a secretary, we need a sports um, journalist person, we need an equipment manager, and we need coaches. If we're going to do a football activity, we need the same, same set of persons. So there are main roles that we need and there are some roles that we can work around. If you are doing it in CXC, you have to play a main role. If we are putting on a football competition, none of you in the option will be playing. Let me make myself clear. If you are doing it in CXC, you do not get the option to play in the competition. It is your grade, and I don't play with students' grade. 
So if your aim is to play in the competition, then you'll get zero for that part of it. This part is a group work. Everybody has to play their own role. Everybody has to support each other. This is where teamwork comes in. We are now at the end of class, and this is the final class for grade 10. The next time I see these amazing students, they'll be in grade 11. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure you hit that subscribe button, like, share, and keep abreast of what is happening with me and my students. Do have a blessed day. Stay blessed, be blessed, and be encouraged on your journey. Well on Malan, I never catch that. Warren, go on and get Malan. Are you? Come to Malan. Malan? 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 Malan said I'm Malan. I'm a shook. Me and Teddy are the front door. I'm a friend. I'm going to be a turn around. Alright. Alright, everybody said I'm peace now. Can't be there.